Welcome to the Football Fancast Fantasy Show. One of the cornerstones of fantasy success is selecting great value players who have low ownership. Remember, if you get your points from the same players that everybody else does, you probably won't do any better than them. So we're going to start off today looking at bargain players with a low TSB or team selected by percentage. Umar Nias is somehow only 5.3% owned and he's earned 19 points in his last two games. He's facing a Southampton team who've let in five goals in their last three matches. And that's terrifying. Glenn Murray might be another decent option. The Brighton man has returned an average of seven points per game in his last four outings, but the best value might be found in Bournemouth's returning hero, Callum Wilson. He bagged a hat-trick and three bonus points last weekend, and he's visiting a Swansea side who've conceded two goals in four of their last five games. At a measly 1.5% ownership, he's certainly my pick for a budget strike option in game week 13. All right, let's take a look at your best captain options for this weekend. Giving the armband to Wilfred Zaha isn't as crazy as it sounds against the Stoke side with a pretty porous defence. And of course, Harry Kane is always a wise choice. And Romelu Lukaku is likely to do well against Brighton, seeing as he broke his drought last week, and he's got a rep for pulling out the big guns against the smaller teams, like visiting Brighton. But also, have a think about Alexis Sanchez. Arsenal have won their last six matches with Burnley, and the Chilean has scored in three of the last five games against them. All right, finally, let's take a look at the Football Fancast League, which you can join using uh, this code for the chance to win cash prizes and Manager of the Month Amazon gift vouchers. We've got yet another league leader, El Ali FC, nailed it last week by captaining Mo Salah. Well played to you. All right, thank you so much for watching. Make good choices in fantasy and all other walks of life. Love to your mothers. See you next time.